All right, you guys. Make sure you like and dislike. Make sure you leave them comments. And don't be a hater. If you're feeling my videos, hit the subscribe button. All right, let's talk about some real shit in this video. Because Miss Jackson is out here trying to expose Floyd Mayweather. All type of shit she's saying about Floyd, a lot of it is subliminal. But I can read through all that subliminal shit. But she's not realizing while she's trying to expose Floyd, she's going to get exposed in the process. So with that being said, I'm going to kill two birds with one stone. Now, Floyd Mayweather Jr., whatever the fuck you want to say about Floyd, if it wasn't for Floyd, we wouldn't even know who this bitch is. Shit, if it wasn't for Floyd, Nelly wouldn't even know who the fuck she is. So I feel like she just used Floyd Mayweather to get her modeling career going. Not only her modeling career, the money, of course, that Floyd Mayweather possesses. If it wasn't for those two things, she wouldn't be with Floyd, man. Let's just keep it a buck. That's why it kills me when she used to talk about all this engagement shit and all this getting married shit. That shit was false. But just hear this bitch out for a second. For I spies on I got some more points I gotta make. Or a big wedding type of girl. I would be so content with the smallest wedding, um, like an intimate setting, um, not too many people. Or even just going down to the courthouse, it's not really a big thing for me. Just as long as Floyd and I are together, it's like not a big issue to have a big wedding. Shut the fuck up, Miss Jackson. I just a got all this bitch do is lie, yo. And Josie Harris said it the best. Floyd Mayweather's baby mama said it the best. They not finna get married. And she wasn't lying, yo. And let me tell you guys this. I was looking for this HBO 24-7 interview on YouTube so I can prove to you guys something that adds to my point. She was subliminally dissing Floyd Mayweather on that show because they had two interviews in the same day. It was one interview with her, and then they had one right after. It was Floyd Mayweather and her. But the interview by herself, she was basically saying, oh, you know, one thing I like about Floyd is he likes to show out for the camera. He's like, he's basically a big show out. And as soon as... As we're behind closed doors, he's a different person. And then I guess she must have thought about it like, mm, let me not say too much now before I lose this money that I'm trying to get from Floyd Mayweather. Not only the money, I can't expand my modeling career. So with that being said, because I'm listen, Miss Jackson, you are fine as hell. I ain't gonna lie. But it's a lot of bad bitches sitting on the bench, Miss Jackson. Ain't doing shit with their life. So with that being said, you being pretty is not a, a free ticket of you being popular like you are now. So with that being said, let me get back to what I was saying. So they did an interview right after she did her interview. And she, Floyd Mayweather was talking throughout the whole fucking interview. And she was looking at Floyd. With a look of disgust. I mean a look of disgust. Like if bot, if if looks could kill. Damn Floyd would have died that day. And like I always tell you guys. Men lie. Women lie. Numbers don't. But I forgot to tell y'all. Men lie. Women lie. Your body language don't lie. And I can't find that fucking interview y'all. Because I want to prove it to y'all. She was looking at Floyd. Like, oh my God, I can't stand this man. If it wasn't for his fucking money, I'd be out. So, let me show you guys something else that adds to my point. Watch this. Okay. Now, I typed in Floyd Mayweather and Miss Jackson, right? Now, watch this. Say I'm bullshitting. Now, 
Don't get me wrong. They got some pictures hugged up. They got some pictures um, being out together. Of course. Of course, she had to play her role. But the thing of the, the fact of the matter is. They don't have pictures like like kissed up, you know, really, you know, really booed up or, you know, it didn't look real. They don't have like no lovable pictures together, y'all. I mean, just the proof is in the pudding. Watch this. I'm going to let y'all look for a minute. Why? Why just shut up? Okay, you see this shit? Okay, that's one. That's that, that's one. Okay, that's one. But even but even that one, you could argue that she don't even look like she's into the fucking um picture like that. Like she's not even into the kiss like that. Like okay, whatever. But then you go to Nelly Emmons Jackson, and she seemed like she is just all over this man. Look at this one. The first look, we just got here. You already see something. So you can tell she really likes Nelly. But she ain't like Floyd like that, man. She like what Floyd possesses. And at the end of the day, when, yeah, Nelly, you got Floyd, bitch, or whatever. But Floyd, I would, if I was Floyd, I wouldn't be mad if I was Floyd. At the end of the day, I had it first. And you can have my leftovers. That's how I would look at that. But just look at the Miss ja look at this look at the Miss Jackson pictures yo it just seems like she's way more on Nelly than um Floyd I mean I'm just saying y'all I caution how I see it man and she seemed like she's into Nelly. She didn't seem like she was really into Mayweather. And that's a fucking fact, y'all. At the end of the day, I'm going to let y'all know right now, y'all. And Nelly and um, Miss Jackson, they got a whole bunch of pictures out there kissing and um, you know, looking booed up like a real relationship is supposed to be. She didn't, I didn't get that vibe from her and Floyd at all. Okay? Bam. And this one right here, in this interview, she says, life with Nelly is like a breath of fresh air. I bet it is, bitch. All right, y'all, I'm out.